What's up, guys? Alfredo here, joined by the lovely Naomi. Yes, hi. What's up, everybody? This is episode two of our Dead Rising 3 Let's Play series. Um, this time, on episode one, I took over the controls, but now <laughs> our fate is in Naomi's hands. That's right, and I'm looking for a weapon. <laughs> uh, flashlight. What else we got there? Coffee cups. A whole bunch of cool things. You can pick up anything in this. I mean, there's a lot of the things that aren't useful, but you can pretty much pick anything up. So. What is the button to pick it up? B. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna use a plate. I'm just uh, joking. yes. Uh, I think we gotta go back outside and then make our way through that okay. zombie. Okay. I just board. don't feel safe yet. Oh my god. Uh, we're you, there's n we will we will never can feel safe. Can I just safe. use this broom? Uh, I guess you can. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sweeping the streets, <laughs> zombies. Clean up the streets. Get ready, guys. Whoops. This is so backwards. next gen is out. Yeah. Finally. Finally. Uh, it's about time. You have, I think, what? We what we is the attack mode on here? We both have each next-gen console, correct? PS4, Xbox One. I have a, sorry, I just hit my Ronda there. Yeah, they sorry, Ronda. The all the time. Um, but uh, we have, yeah. Yeah, I have a PS4 and an Xbox One. I have you an have Xbox One. Yeah. And, and the PS4. I've been using it. Do you have this in reverse mode? No. Oh. No. I'm no inverted player. I'm not one of those guys. Or one of those guys with like the legacy controls that are all like southpaw and really right. weird. No, that's not how I roll. You gotta do things the right way. And but I'm doing things the right, the wrong way <laughs> by using this plank of wood. That thing's not gonna last long. But so okay, so what what games do you have on the Xbox One? Right now I have Rise: Son of Rome. Um, and we talked about it in the earlier episode. We like it. I love it a lot. I think it's a beautiful game. I think. If you're right now just with your console and you're not sure what to play, like, Rise Son of Rome is actually a really good game. Despite what people are saying, uh, you know, repetitive gameplay or yeah. whatever, I still think that it's worth I seeing it just because know. of how beautiful it I is. I think I just, I just love, like, the Greek mythology and the Romans and, like, that kind of time period. Yeah. Like, it's just, it's really nice. It's fascinating, and it's, I mean... It's not 100% accurate, but I, from what no, I've exactly. done, I've done a Let's Play with Megan Sullivan, which you guys can probably see on the site very and the, soon. The, the pacing for the story is a little weird, but uh, the story's been pretty good. Yeah. Although, I, I, wouldn't, I wouldn't go as far as saying to buy the game. It's a six-hour game, so it's a must-rent. So maybe more rent it? Yeah. Is your... Okay. So I picked up... The, I picked up... Well, I rented Rise, and then I picked up Dead Rising 3. I don't have Rise yet, but I'm playing it now, and it's awesome. And I picked up... Well, I'm a... Sh I'm an FPS guy, so I picked up Battlefield 4 and Call of Duty, which Battlefield 4 looks beautiful. See, that's what I was curious about because I'm not a f <laughs> here I am hitting them with a the plate. With a plate, yep. Oh, okay, I think I saw a gun. There you go. Uh, yep, and we, we got to I mean wake our way Sorry. 73 meters back. Oh, I'm using that. There you go. Oh, there it is. Yep. Let's get to safety. Uh, but yeah, Battlefield 4 is beautiful. Call of Duty is... Uh, I mean, on the Xbox One, it doesn't look that great. It looks a lot better on the PS4 um, in terms of <laughs> multiplayer. Right. Well, I'm definitely interested in Battlefield 4 just because I'm not I'm not on either side of the playing field, right? Call of right. Duty or Battlefield 4. I kind of play first-person shooters on occasion. Now, what am mm -hmm. I supposed to do at this just point? Just got to hit that button, and, uh, and, then, and there's a surprise. If you look to your right. If you look up. Why is that weird? Maybe I am an inverted no, player. No, <laughs> no, 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 charge him head first. <laughs> There's a oh, car. Oh, they want us Let's to Let's just run him over with the car. That's a lot safer to run him over with I the car. I agree. Um, still getting used to the controls, obviously. <laughs> uh, we'll and get there, what the people. gameplay is. But, uh, because I played the demo. Oh, I love this. We played this at the Xbox One event. They had a we tournament there. We played it there. very briefly. Um, I played it very briefly. The tournament was who can kill the most zombies within the time of That's the right. entire demo. It was really We're fun. Unlocking achievements. I think I you unlocked an achievement. Did I unlock it? Uh. Yeah. Are we on your gamer tag or mine? I don't know. We're on we're on a gamer tag, <laughs> and this gamer tag now has achievements. It now has <laughs> a gamer the score. The zombie that's higher. killing achievement. I just love how how many zombies are on the screen at once with this game. Yeah. So you played the first two, or you just played the first one? Uh, I played the first one extensively, and then with the second one, I didn't really touch it too much. I don't okay. know because I just I I felt like it was just too. I don't know. I, I, I want. I didn't really feel threatened by the zombies. And right. I was like zombies are dangerous. You know, things like they're a scary thing. I'm over here like yes. messing around with them, and I feel like with this version of the game, they kind of 
really found their balance where it's like it they do have that like gritty feel to it but then at the same time like it you do get to be um fun with it if you want to be fun right so um other title i have is assassin's creed 4 see uh, now I, I played assassin's creed 1 and 2 and then after that i was like i'm done with this series and then it didn't get any better uh and then everyone's saying it's starting to come back I mean, I think they did a really good job with this uh, version of, like, the going in full pirate mode. <laughs> do we s do we save that survivor? So we're. I wasn't sure what to do with him. Oh okay, yeah, let's save him. I was like, should I save? So him? I some of I the best ways to, to get like experience points in this game is saving survivors, defeating okay. psychos, and um. Do I just have to wait for him to challenges. jump on? No, just uh, clear all the zombies right next to him. Oh okay. Yeah. See, I wasn't so sure what to do. There's probably like two or three. There you go. Finally. Yeah, although there's still one zombie there. Just be careful. Yeah, and we got 3,000 prestige points, I believe they're called. Okay. Um, yeah, I so want to go back to now up more. to where um, I'm headed. Yeah, now we got to head down that way. It's a little hard but seeing where to go, especially with all these zombies uh, around blocking the yeah, way. Yeah, that's the one thing I, I have against this game is that uh, the map isn't that intuitive. I have to go into the main menu screen a lot okay. uh, to kind of have a sense of where I'm going, and that's the back button. I'm doing I don't know what all right they call the back button anymore. No. It's like a weird snap picture. Oh, yeah, here we are. Here we are. But yeah, if you take down Hello. psychos, if you complete, um, you know, things where you save survivors, those are the best ways to level up your character. Or if you make combo vehicles or combo weapons and you just kill m mass zombies, that's probably the funnest way to, to level up. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Or uh, the survivor challenges. They'll get you like 80,000 prestige points, which can like easily just rank up your character. Awesome. What's your character at now? Uh, 25. Nice. And I'm like three days left. Very cool. So like halfway through. Getting there. Awesome. Where are the police? Where's the army? Let's see, give me a few while. Let's see what's going on here. Yeah. Ooh. She likes to complain. Well, she does. <laughs> the thing, too, is, like, people, like, shoot zombies in the head, like, point blank, or, like, she just stabbed that one with a crowbar, and there's not enough blood splatter on people when that mm, happens, ever. Yeah. Walking dead. That would have been a nice, game. like, little detail to add. Yeah. Make it a bit more realistic. You think it'd be a lot more bloodier. Mm-hmm. Oh, barely Nick, you're anything. the errand boy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, it seems they m they like making Nick go do all the scary. Well, he and is the hard stuff. he is a uh, <laughs> he is a modern day MacGyver. Yep. Oh, He's that's the hero. Suck. I would not want to use weapons where I got where I have to be extremely close. Oh gosh. I would like or in, uh, in episode one how you were talking about you. I was talking about bringing cleaver. yeah bringing knives. It's too close for me. <laughs> Way well, too it. close. I, what you else like do you have at home to bat. use? I know exactly. I don't have a baseball bat. I don't have a gun. You know, it's one of those things. I think I'd probably just use my legs more than anything to run away from them. Exactly, the best weapon. Yep. He looks so young here. Like a teen, maybe 20 something. Nick? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, in this shot. Like 20. He's got the baggy pants, maybe. And the sneakers. <laughs> 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 the, the pants look like Jabos. Yeah.
later. <laughs> oh. But to show New you content. Oh, yeah, that's right. You could um, with the Xbox One Smart Glass app. Um, you can go into this game and you can do additional stuff with uh, content. The more I think I just like jumping on these tables. Um, what would All you right. use? Um, I like the electric electric prod. Prod sounded. I would, or I would try to find a saw and another sledgehammer and create that uh, combo weapon again. They've got some really devastating combo weapons in this game, which we will come across hopefully later. What? No. Uh. They give you a really rad combo vehicle, um, the turret rig, like pretty, pretty uh, early on too. And that thing just demolishes people. That was actually the no. vehicle that won the uh, Dead Rising 3 tournament. <laughs> this is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, really? Yeah. That's crazy. Some dude uh, put it together. Um, <laughs> started I didn't even zombies. focus on that. I was just killing zombies at that point. So I'm still going with the electric prod. Obviously, I had a little trouble there grabbing what I needed. Um, um, let's take a quick turnaround and see where our marker's at. Not there, not there. Is it once you see it that it'll appear? Or once you're in that direction? Let's hit back and we can go to the map. Okay. Uh, let's see. And then, yep, there you go. Press A. Just select mission as primary objective by pressing A. All right. And then we can pan around. How do we... Oh, we're uh, just... Using yeah, we'll probably hit left trigger to zoom out. Um, oh, this map's a little slower than I'm used to. Yeah, and you, we have to visit this map uh, very often um, in the game, so it gets a little tedious. But I'm not seeing the marker. Explore while uh, Rhonda's busy. So what we could do is just go for... Oh, okay, so let's go for a blueprint, and then let's go for a statue. We can show people what that looks like. Um, so, so if we go... Go back to the menu... If we turn around, we want to um, head to where? Should I put a checkpoint? Um, can we do that here. in this game? Not can we get no, set waypoint? We can. So if we hit the um, blue um, sign, there we go. Oh, we can. Sweet. Yeah. So I'm going to head back. Uh, yeah. So there should be a blueprint, and the blueprint are the keys to creating combo weapons uh, to your left and on top of that truck over there. Are that, you sure? Um, I think it's behind. Okay. It is. We'll, we'll be good. So just kind of prod. <laughs> I can't wait till we uh, start fighting like ridiculous clothing. Um, and then you kind of just end up cross dressing at some point. So. If we hit right there and we'll jump on top through the front. Oh, we want to jump yeah. onto oh the truck. Oh, no. It's okay. I got this. Cool. And then now here's our combo weapon. Oh! Uh, no! <laughs> Oh, you dropped the prod along with it's it. It's okay. We got a combo weapon. We got or a we something up there to maybe? grab. Why is he? Oh, oh, the controls are a little weird. You are okay. I'm slip sliding. I think the uh, it got me because. Oh yeah, the heavy metal sledgehammer. I love how when you do actually get the blueprints, the weapons are right next to it, so you can instantly just create it and then just go to town on the zombies. Cool. How do you create the weapon again? So pick. Uh, yeah, so you picked up the pipe. Now we got to pick up the, I think you have a 2x4. Yeah. Yeah, so pick both of those up. Both of them? Mm -hmm. But if I let it go, it's just going to um, do that. So we're going to have to hold RB. Oh. And then <laughs> probably drop these plates. Uh, yeah, and then we'll drop the plates. Pick that up. All right. Then hold RB, then tap. Hold RB, and then press A. A. Okay. And then just, there you go, just hold RB. Oh, and you get nice. to create a weapon, and then we can just go to town. And I think well, the point is is to um, kind of show people right now like what the combo weapons are. Okay. And, uh, so I just want to go in and attack. Um, I mean, now we want to kind of head towards... Uh, the ooh, hotel? I think there's a, an assault rifle right behind you. Where? Oh, here. Yeah. Um, probably drop that broom that we have. Oh, okay, cool. We have that. Uh, see if you can't get on the roof. I think there might be like a uh, what's called a tragic event is where you guy you kind of get to like mm. see what's going on. I don't think uh, I can get up there. Oh, look there at that! You then you hover over, yeah, right there, and it kind of tells you he like kind of remorses and like feels really sad about like what happened here. This guy. Yeah. Aww. Should be able to. Uh, if you think if you, pr if you press B over it, 
then you'll pick that up. That's what I'm thinking, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, it's so difficult because then there's times where, like, right now we want to press B over that dead body. Oh. But there's so many, like... Things around it. Things around it, so you accidentally start It can get confusing, yeah, like, so now we're... Oh, no! And we fell off. <laughs> oh, God. Okay, we'll get up there. Get out of my way. I'm not even touching you. I'm just going um, to. So, go. yeah, I mean, those those give you experience points, too, as well. It's um, 2,000. I'm not sure if it gives you more. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Yeah. All right. Let's try this once more. Where's my? So are oh, you that's are you what console are you leaning towards right now? So I'm very happy with what I have right now. My Xbox One is awesome. I think. Oh, it's really annoying. I just want to press B in front of this guy, and I have to, like, remove all I these <laughs> items around <laughs> well, him. I start throwing things, like, away from the scene, uh, and then I eventually start picking that stuff up. Okay, can you drop something and not pick something up, or is that not possible? Yeah. Because uh, I'm pressing B, and it's not letting it's not me working. go. No. Um, try left trigger, right trigger. You should be able to throw it or something. Uh, probably not with this because it's a... Um, it's a gun it's or a something. Gun. Yeah, uh, um, Right there. You, you have it selected. See how it's highlighted? There, there you, you go. go. Oh, my God. <laughs> 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 we didn't drop our combo weapon, did we? We should probably switch with that assault rifle. We probably still have it in our... Let's see here. Yeah, we still have it. We ziz goods. Nice. But, yeah. My Xbox One's cool. I... Like, I do watch a lot of TV <laughs> and movies and stuff, so yeah, it's so just it's the perfect per for you. It's yeah. entertainment. Yeah. All in one. But it's still got good games. I think down the road there'll be more good games. I'm not. I'm just like letting it <laughs> sit here as I talk, you know. <laughs> no, I'm just put that in the controller and start like casually from talking. From killing zombies. <laughs> I was like, hold on, we're killing zombies here. Um, let's take a look. Let's, let's take a look at the map. Just want to get this assault rifle. Let's. Uh, we might have to pick up. It says investigate. Oh, right here. That's where we need to go. Oh yeah. So this is the hotel he was talking about, or. Um. This guy. We can set a waypoint oh. there, and then we'll head over there, and then that this should guy? progress. Oh, five days, fourteen hours. Uh, yep, right there. And then okay. we'll progress the story. That'll cool. be awesome. Yeah, the more we can progress in this game, the better. Um, I think everyone I'm wants loving, to see uh, what's going on. The PlayStation on. Four, I think, has Up come a long way. That controller, uh, I can't say enough about that controller. It's yeah. So good. Uh, the I mean. But the I'm used to. Is pretty pretty flawless. But I feel like that's what PlayStation should have done with their last generation. I'm like going the wrong way. <laughs> But it's like, I want to avoid the zombies. In terms of the Xbox 360, I think there's a, I mean, Xbox, there's with the Xbox One, there's a lot of flaws, but I see, like, progression. There's I see so much innovation yeah, in I this Yeah, I see, it's like, they can actually, there's something more that, that there's going to, that's mm. to the console within a couple of years. Right. Um, the Kinect is beautiful when it's actually working. How do I, Oh boo, I dropped my assault wire. You can groom them to death. So, when you select your, okay, you're just pressing... Uh, LB at or RB, yep. RB at that point, and then then that's how you switch. That's it how you're switching it, yeah. yeah. Okay. So Gnomes is like just barely picked Sorry. up this game <laughs> right now. In case you're wondering like why she's not obliterating the zombies at a exponential rate. Yeah, there's some learning I have to do just in terms of the what buttons to press exactly. when and what are the mechanics. I just come here. I'm coming to this game after. Whoa, sorry, playing Rise. So. The, the controls which in that game are really completely cool. <laughs> different. <laughs> which has amazing execution moments, by the way. Like, it's they get repetitive though. And see, but there's see, so many little I'm things that they could have done to make that game better. Of course, of course. Like, but for me, it's almost only like three different barbarian like yeah. that you actually kill. And it's like really like that makes it even more repetitive than it is. My thing is. I think the game is so pretty and the story is really good and I, I loved being in that world. That that almost compensates for how repetitive the gameplay is in that game. Yeah. For me, anyway. I'm... Yeah. Uh, all right. I'd say we'll, we'll get to this So is it is it? Yeah. I'm going to get to this checkpoint. I, I do have one more question, though, for you, Alfredo. Yeah. When we go and we're attacking zombies, is this just building up our... S like our stamina or our XP, uh, like is there anything going towards this building uh, up this character? Yeah, it, it earns you prestige points. Okay. And then with those prestige points, you um, you can essentially level up your attributes. Okay. And that goes with everything: health, stamina. So you want to try to kill as many zombies as possible. Yeah. What I did initially is like I took all my attribute points and I dumped all that into my melee weapon ability. Okay. 
um, because yeah, you have guns, but the ammo is scarce, and the ability to just kind of like mash people. I mean, this I don't even mashing people with. Yeah, I don't even think I would even bother with yeah. guns. Even though he's at this a point. really good shot off the bat. Like, this guy is yeah, really good. You can even level it up, which makes me wonder. Like I'm starting to level that up. Right. But we'll see like how much of a better shot I can actually be. <laughs> but uh, you you're you're the type of player that really like beats the hell out of all these zombies. I just run through them. Yeah. I mean, right now it's like Right, you j you just picked it up. So you're I'm having, having fun, fun with it. it. You're it's just like, you know what? I just I just want to do what this game is about. Killing yeah. zombies with, with brooms like because <laughs> that's That's as good as it gets for me. Uh Probably going up, yeah. Yeah, we'll head up uh, through the left. Ooh. That confused me so many times before. I was like, uh, every time, because I think I had to come here a couple of times. She makes you like collect stuff, and I was just like, oh my goodness. Oh, like up here. Where yeah. The opening is. But uh, I think we could. I should probably. Yeah. We could stop right here. We should sign this um, off. Yeah, we'll stop right here. But that is episode two. Um, Make sure to hit us up on Twitter. <laughs> Let us know how these <laughs> are going. Yeah. We got, we got quite distracted on this one. This one's a little... This was, this was Naomi's, like, uh, like getting used to the controls. My test run. Thing. Let's just call it that. Exactly. My test run. <laughs> so we'll let things run here. We'll see what's up with this conversation real quick. Yeah. There won't be a later if I don't get this done. Wait. Okay, who are you with? Huh? Are you a snitch? Ooh. <laughs> she's on the defensive. She's really out Hello. Of yeah, poor guy just came back from like killing a bunch of zombies. Just being very insensitive. All right. Um. Oh, we shouldn't have talked. Oh. I'll just let her. I will continue this. I'll let him ramble. Ah, do I have to like break a window or something? No, eventually that'll be unlocked after we complete things. Okay. All right, so we'll we'll on leave the, this here. On the next episode, <laughs> we'll pick up Anna's break hands. I think her name is Anna. Yeah, it is Anna. Cool. All right, well, guys, uh, we stumbled. We killed zombies. <laughs> yeah, as long as we did that, we did but, our uh, job. But that's episode two. Naomi, thanks for joining me. Thanks for having me, and you're you're teaching me a lot about this game. <laughs> we will kill more zombies on the next. And episode. I'm ready to kill more zombies in the next episode. All right, guys, thanks for joining us. See uh, you guys later. <laughs>